done multiple one-on-one -on -one fights on this channel before, but this one is going to be even more interesting than the others only because it's Myrnal vs. Moral Maris Absorbed, which a lot of people I will say on my main channel wanted to see this fight go down in actual manga format, so what I wanted to do right now is I wanted to do a best out of three showcase. So right now I'm going to be using Ultra Instinct Moral or of course Moral with Maris Absorbed vs. Myrnal, and right off the cuff I'm going to say that in this particular fight, Myrno stomps, right? Myrno realistically based on scaling and based on his overall determination and just overall skill set as a warrior, I think, would be able to put someone like Moral Maris down easily, or Morris in this case, but in the comment section below, if you guys feel differently, if you guys believe that maybe Morris could somehow edge out Myrno, or if you guys believe that Myrno would absolutely just shit stomp Morris in, then let me know in the comment section below, and I think that Honestly speaking, although this would be a cool concept, which I might end up doing in manga format, depending on, of course, if you guys want to see it or not, I think that by the end of this, there's no question that Myrno would stomp out Morris. But, Morris got the victory, so I want to see right now if Myrno can kind of turn it around and get the victory over Morris. And here we go, so now we're going to be selecting Myrno to battle against Moral Maris Absorbed, and interestingly enough, I think that going forward, we do need to introduce angelic level enemies for characters like Goku, Vegeta, etc. And I think that someone like Myrno would be way too much only because in the main Myrno story, we understand that Myrno would often fight his opponent to even himself out with his opponent to get information out of them and to basically gauge their power at their fullest because Realistically speaking, let's just say, if Myrno were to fight Moro, then Myrno would even his power out with Moro just to gain a better understanding as to where he stands, and to kind of gauge him out by siphoning his power and getting more information out of him, before of course the conclusion which would be Moro having to be ultimately surpassed by Myrno as he goes on to use his full power. So this is not going to be as easy as I thought it would be, only because right now, I think that for these mods, Moro is, I think, superior when it comes down to health and strength, so I think that this Myrno mod might be in trouble. He might be in trouble only because I think that with all things considered, if I'm not careful, then this is definitely going to favor Moro here, which I don't want to happen. However, I do want you guys to let me know in the comment section below as to what kind of one-on-one -on -one fight you guys want to see in the future on this channel because we've done so many one-on-one -on -one fights before. If you guys have missed out on them, then you guys can find those playlist links located down below. We literally have tons upon tons of videos on the channel for you guys to check out. So I think that with this, when considering all things, Morris, I think just to see the way he was able to kind of compete with MUI Goku to a standstill per se before he merged into the earth was really, really good. But I think that by the end of it, there's no question that Myrno would definitely take the cake here. So what I think is most fascinating right now is the fact that I am literally trying my best to get the better of him, and I'm not even too confident or sure if I am able to kill him, only because I know that his gauge for health and his strength is much more superior than mine, right? So he has more health than me, he could dish out more damage to me, so I think that what I need to do is play into the speed card, right? Because if Moro hits me, I would say, with one of his ultimates, it's over, right? So this fight is uh, this fight would be done. So I need to try and avoid that by any means necessary. So and I love the overall background, right? They're fighting in this abandoned, destroyed city, right? You have this sense of desperation, this sense of hopelessness, you know, desolation all around. So I, I kind of like that. So let me see if I have any kind of like leeway here in this fight, only because if you guys noticed. Moro is kind of also bringing the fight to me because every single time I am trying to attack him from a distance or, you know, trying to get, you know, some sort of like leeway on him, he keeps like rushing me. So Moro, I think, is playing this a little, a little differently, I would say. Like, in, instead of just keeping our distance, he just wants to go head on. So in the comment section below, however, I do want to know. What are your initial thoughts on the moral character in the Dragon Ball Super manga? Did you guys enjoy him? Did you guys dislike him? Also for the Myrno character, because the Myrno adaptation was done differently by comparison to the original creator to mine, because my version of Myrno is very different than the actual original, original version, right? So with Moro, 
I was actually considering on doing my own version of him, except I wasn't going to have him look so generic. I was actually going to have him look like an actual Baphomet-like character, like an actual satanic figure. So that's neither here nor there. I think that for the time being, we're going to wait. But I do want to say thank you all. See, that's, that's the attack. That's the attack right there. That is the attack. If that were to hit me, it would have been over. So there goes my item. I need to do whatever I can to try to win this fight. And thankfully enough, the timer, there is no timer. So I, I can actually do as I please without getting myself into trouble here, especially in this fight with, uh, with Mr. Morris here. So I want to thank you all so much for the overwhelming support on the channel. It's whatever you guys want to see. So if you guys are new to the channel, I do encourage you guys to smash that subscribe button. And also give this video a big fat thumbs up. It always helps us out with the algorithm. And um, that's just that's just my, my, my call, my call to action for you guys to just do those two things. All right, so honestly, I think Myrtle's gonna lose. I think Myrtle's gonna lose because Look at what I'm doing to him, right? I am doing everything I can to get the better of this dude, and he is not falling at all. Like, there's nothing. I, I, I don't even think I'm putting a dent in this dude because I'm attacking him, as you can see, with everything that I have, and yet he is able to tank everything at, you know, at, 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 at almost as if nothing is even affecting him to begin with, right? So I honestly think by the end of this, this is going to go towards Morris because judging based on the way I'm fighting him, nothing's affecting him. So that's just a testament. So my my prediction right now, oh yes, can I hit him with this? Yes, yes, yes. This is MUI Goku's attack. There we go. All right, so did that do the trick and it did nothing. Okay, so again, that's how, yo guys, I want you to go back and look at how many times I just hit this dude with some fire, right? I hit this dude with some fire and not a single thing has affected him. So that's that's how you know right now that this is bad because this dude is literally, yo, he he, he just, ta I can't believe he tanked that. He tanked, I, I wanna see if I can try that exact ultimate one more time. If I can try that attack one more time, then I think I will be able to kind of, you know, be able to like say to myself, all right, well, okay, here we go. Then he's at least, he's at least closer to death. All right, is this it? Is this the finishing blow? And it is not. Okay, this is very bad. Yo, this dude Moro, his body, th this kind of goes back to what Goku had said and the androids have said about Moro's body. This dude has a body that's made out of steel because he is not going down. Unless, I I'm gonna try that attack one more time. Because there's no way that he's able to survive that attack at, at least three times, right? So maybe I can get him on the third try, or maybe I can use something else. But either way, his body, due to his overall increase in, uh, of health, is just astronomically higher than mine. So I'm going to have to try to figure something out in order to finally put this... My hands are so sweaty right now because I... Oh, we got him. We got him. Oh, we got him. All right. Moral up one. Myrtle up one. Let's just see if Moro can pull off the victory one more time. Okay, so I'm gonna be honest. I really think that Moro is going to take this fight only because, like I said before, his health gauge is way up there compared to Myrtle. But if I end up getting a modified Myrtle mod, then we might do things a little differently. So by the end of all of this, guys, I want to thank you all so much for watching. I want to thank you all so much for your time. If there is any one-on-one -on -one fight you guys want to see, best out of three or best out of five, or if there's any other kind of team fight you guys want to see, then let me know in the comment section below. Demoro is whipping this dude pretty bad, right? And I think that with control, Moro feels... I, I, would, I would add more to his moveset, right? Because I, I feel as though the revamp characters that the Xenoverse 2 revamp team had done are much better than any of the standardized version characters that we have here, but I don't know. I, I, oh, he, he really got me good with that. Okay, Myrno, Myrno got me good with one solid attack. I, I was not expecting that, but I think that Myrno's days are numbered here. So I think that I'm going to put Moro against some of the other heavy hitters in the game because what's interesting about it Xenoverse 2 is so many, you know, different kinds of characters. I mean, their their health is upscaled, their speed is upscaled, so I, I might put Moro against some of the higher hitting mods, like for example, the Super Saiyan 8s, the God Brolies and stuff like that. Like those mods from back, you know, 2017, 2018, 
those mods were pretty broken, so I want to see if Moral can kind of outlast that. Yo, this man's speed is real. Look at the finesse, and Mo Myrno's trying to catch me, but let's see if I can finish. Oh, there we go. We finally got him by accident, too. Again, thank you all so much for your time. I hope you guys enjoyed. Hit that subscribe button. Give this video a big fat thumbs up, and I'll be seeing you all down in the comment section below. Take it easy, guys. Peace.